You see that? What's up guys? So today I have a really good episode for you. The question was brought to us by one of our YouTube subscribers about our wall system. And I wanted to do something involving this system right here. And so I thought, what better day than Friday? The question came in, I think, on a Tuesday. So anyways, today we're gonna go through everything there is to know about this wall system. Let's get started. So one of the first things that I wanna do is a flame test. This stuff is what they call fire retardant. It'll burn, but the flame spread is so slow, and I'll show you what I mean. So I got a blowtorch right now, and now I'm gonna burn this thing. See what I mean? Let's do it again. Show you what I mean. So I got the flame, right? Now watch what happens. You see that? That's what I'm talking about. So it'll ignite, but the second the flame's gone, it's out. So it has a very, very high burn uh, spread. Uh, what do they call it? No. Burn, uh, uh, I lost my train of thought. Man, all this fire and brimstone. Um, it's a very slow burn rate, has a high flame spread. So the fact is, is that it's got a two hour burn rate. And, see? Nice and soft to the touch. It always scares me a little bit after I torch the hell out of a wall to touch it again. Now, there's something very interesting going on here. Did you hear the snap, crackle, and pop? Much similar to you would um, in Rice Krispie Treats. You hear that? All right, so that's moisture in the, in the wall system, which brings me to my next point. All right, so when it comes to moisture, the snap, crackle, pop, and all that kind of stuff, there's a lot of stuff going on. I just hit this with a ton, a ton of heat. So I'm gonna move out of here so you can hear me, because that snap, crack, crackle, and pop is actually distracting me. So these walls are cured with steam. So what happens is, is that they're put into a, uh, a press. So the wall system is actually two parts, which I'm gonna show you right now. So this wall system is actually two-part system. And if you can see, it has an interior and an, ex or an interior and an exterior wall. And then they sit inside this track on the top and the bottom. And when the panels interlock together, which I'll show you on the back side of here, they have what's it's almost like a puzzle piece. And they interlock together like that. And this is actually what we would consider the interior side of the wall. I had a bunch of scrap panels, so I thought I'd throw together, and I kind of lost train of thought. I'm so excited about this today. So, this is a standard window opening. Um, everything is already done for us. So, we don't have to cut anything out. The wall's been framed. And everything. So a lot of people think that with this wall system that we have to uh, cut all the wall openings and doors and windows and all that kind of stuff. And in fact, it's a puzzle piece. The, the plans say panel one, two, three, four, five, six, all the way up to 30, sometimes 34 panels. So it's a really cool system. The next thing I wanna do is I wanna try to break this piece on top of here. So if you see, I kinda made a little roof. And this is still crackling. It is really gooey, but it looks moltenly hot, but I can tell you right now. And, and to be honest with you, I mean, we're only halfway through. And, and whose house is gonna get hit with that kind of blowtorch, you know what I mean? It's gonna be like a nice, calm flame. So that was really extreme, but let me get on the roof. All right, so one of the sketchy things about going up on this roof is that I really didn't put it together that well. These are just a bunch of sloppy pieces that I had around the shop. But I wanted to show you that I weigh 195 pounds. And I mean, it's not that stable, but from not being that stable, with just a couple of little screws in here, 
pretty solid. And there is no plywood. So with no plywood, a couple of screws, you can think how much stronger this actual system would be when we actually put it together the right way. Well listen, I want to thank you very much for tuning in today. I thought this would be a fun Friday afternoon video. Please like, comment, and share this video. And if you haven't subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for, click the button below, and I'll see you tomorrow.